sometimes we need these peaceful laid back just doing something we enjoy being out in nature taking in what all god has created kind of afternoons don't we Hey, hey, y'all. Hang on, we're about to walk down there with them. We came down to the river for the afternoon. Thought we would bring you with us. Everybody else has already walked down with fishing poles, and this little guy's like, come on, mama. Let's go. Ooh, don't let the tree hit us. Let's go, mama. Stop standing around. They, they saw fish, and they were like, let's go. I'm going. Come on. <laughs> There's no standing around waiting. I think we can make it. Here we come. Here we come. And it was a good one too. You see them gar laying on the bottom right there? Where at? Hmm. Where at? There's a gar right there. Two of them. Yeah. Top of the water down there. Daddy, there's two of them. That is so cool. Look at that black one swimming down the middle. I've never seen them See before. See that black one swimming down the middle? Oh, damn, they are taking mine. There's always been, there's always been black in, the, in this river. Uh-oh. Where's the ground? Yeah, you want to go down there? I'll have to take your socks off. It's not going any further right now, okay? Stay right here. doing <laughs> Let's watch where you step hey, there, there's bees <laughs> yep bees pollinating a 
Mama. Mommy. Okay. It's gonna be wet. Ooh, it is gonna be slick. Be careful. Wyatt, you have a fish! <laughs> Teeth on his tongue. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I did it, back. Mama. I did it. But do you want me here? Where we're going? And he come out and whammed it. That's tactic. That way it's hard to Mm-hmm. Don't look for him. I mean, even if you don't see him, still throw it. Look at that. Little bass. He's in this. I think this. You gonna put him back in? Go on, little guy. what I needed this afternoon sometimes we need these peaceful laid back just doing something we enjoy being out in nature taking in what all God has created kind of afternoons don't we watching the kid get muddy and play in the sand watching the big kids get excited watching my hubby get excited <laughs> he's a big kid too this one back here where's he at there he is Hetty is kind of. Oh, he's got a problem. What is it, baby? Hey, I'll come help you. He's just wanted to be off by himself. <laughs> you hold this for mom. Hold this. Probably have to have daddy fixed it, probably. What there? Fixed. You didn't need daddy to fix it. Mama got it. Look at those sandy toes. Sitting here thinking too about how Justin's great grandparents, how excited they must have been when they first got this land here. How hard they worked for it. All the time that Justin has spent here over the years. Oh, the memories that this place holds. <laughs> you know, I have memories here, but they have even more. And continuing to make new ones every day, huh? I help but wonder if when his great-grandparents bought this, if they knew or thought about one day their great-great-grandchildren out here fishing in the river. And getting plum filthy. It's <laughs> the best way to be, huh? We just got back home. I was gonna go out to the big garden, the summer garden, and look at the peppers that are still out there. But I'm tired. <laughs> I don't know that that's gonna happen today, we'll see. We also, and I'll take you out there and show you just a minute. We also this morning added a little extra to our fall garden. We added a couple rows and planted some, what do we plant, purple top turnips. So we'll have turnips and turnip greens. I'll show you that. Thought I'd give you a peek at supper. Gotta shred this up, but it's crock pot chicken stuff. And then all you gotta do is put some chicken breasts in the bottom, and then I put a packet of chicken stuffing mix on the top of it. And then on top of that, I mix together a can of cream of chicken, about eight ounces of sour cream, and a little bit of milk, and then just spread that over the top. And it's been cooking on low all day. I'm gonna shred it up, maybe make some. Steamed broccoli to go with it. Wyatt fell asleep on the way back to the house. He wore himself out. <laughs> we all did. All right, you can see, so we added these two rows here. And I planted both rows all the way down in those turnips. I 
think tomorrow too I'm gonna go ahead and get something and stake the cucumbers so that as soon as they start climbing they'll have something to climb on because they'll be there before long you got their first true leaves so it won't be long chicken chores are already done for the day maybe we'll just relax the rest of the afternoon not that we've not had a relaxing day i mean it just wears you out though when it's all said and done and you're ready to sit down.